live from the Atlantis, Paradise Island, Bahamas. Welcome to the 2009 Miss Universe Preliminary Competition. And now, let's meet the 84 beautiful contestants. We've been hard at work in rehearsal this week. You won't see any of our production numbers tonight, but you will see a lot of amazing competition on the stage. My name is Michael Schwant, and I'm the choreographer for Miss Universe, and these girls have been working extremely hard for you guys. So please so, show some support with a strong applause. Let's meet our contestants. Hasna Zukichi, 21, Albania. Joana Lasic, 23, Argentina. Diane Cruz, 22, Aruba. Rachel Finch, 21, Australia. Kiara Sherman, 26, Bahamas. Ethiopia. Britain. 
Viana Zorgenak Campanile 19, Greece! Racing Manley 24, Guam! Lourdes Figueroa 21, Guatemala! Janelle Cox 19, Guyana! Belgica Suarez 23, Miss Honduras! Sofia, 18, Russia. Denise 
Elisa Mendrejová, 23, Slovak Republic. Mirela Gorac, 22, Slovenia. Tatum Keshwe, 25, South Africa. Estivali Pereira, 23, Spain. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our host for the evening, local radio personality, Ed Fields. Thanks, Michael. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for joining us this evening uh, for the 2009 Miss Universe Preliminary Competition. Tonight's show is going to be webcast live around the world, courtesy of Ustream and the New Tech TriCaster. You're, if you're, whether you're watching the show here at Atlantis or from your computer at home, you're about to see 84 of the most beautiful women in the world compete for a change, chance of a lifetime. Joining me this evening is a woman who needs no introduction. Please put your hands together for my co-host, Miss Universe 2008, Diana Mendoza. Absolutely smashing. Thank you, you too. We got a match. Yeah, we got the pink thing going. Yep. Ladies and gentlemen, I just got to tell you, this is the, I work here at Atlantis, and uh, I'm happy to be putting in the overtime tonight. <laughs> so tell us, Diana, what have you been doing for the last uh, year during your reign? I never stopped traveling. No. I never stopped making controversy. <laughs> I never stopped taking my clothes off. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, okay, that's another story. We'll get into that. <laughs> Well, we're just moments away from bringing the contestants back here to here, but before we do that, let's, well, I'll tell you what, let's go over here. Stop. Let's get comfortable after you. Thank you. And we'll, uh, we'll get our judges on the road. All nice and comfy? Comfy, comfy. Comfy, Thank there you, you come. All right, well, we're gonna introduce our judges, ladies and gentlemen, and to start off with, she has over 15 years experience in the fashion modeling industry and is currently the president of Trump Model Management. Please welcome Corinne Nicholas. A successful talent producer, he worked on the Academy Awards and the Grammys and helped catapult the careers of several international recording artists. Steven Skilocci. 
a 15-year veteran of the fashion industry. She's currently the director of retail operation for Michael Kors. Please welcome Tisa T. A veteran of the hospitality industry is currently the vice president of sales for a successful event planning company, Todd Winston. She hosts various charitable, social, and staff events here at Atlantis and is a founding executive of Quality Focus Incorporated, a hotel secret shopper service. Sarah Martin-Tonis. An Emmy-nominated executive producer, his credits include Last Call with Carson Daly and Last Coming Standing. He's currently developing TV shows for NBC. David Friedman. A licensed attorney and former real estate developer, this entrepreneur is a much respected philanthropist. Please welcome Adriana Ching. A finalist on season three on NBC's The Biggest Loser, he serves as vice president of talent relations for the nonprofit organization's best buddies, Mark Wiley. Born in Vietnam, she's the most sought-after jewelry designer for such celebrities as Paris Hilton and Tom Hanks. Rosalina Translister. He's performed on TV and in film, and is a successful choreographer and dancer. He's worked with numerous stars, including Justin Timberlake and Jamie Foxx. Mario Mosley. Let's give another round of applause for our judges, ladies and gentlemen. They do have a top job tonight. They Choosing 15 out of 84 beautiful women, and it's not an easy task. That's going to be a rough one. So why, why don't we just get started? So uh, without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's begin with the 2009 Miss Universe Swimsuit Competition. Let's begin the swimsuit competition with Albania. 21-year-old Albania says she's got a great sense of humor. Whenever her friends are sad, she's the one that can always cheer them up. Turning frowns upside down, it's Albania. Angola. After learning as a child, Angola was yelled at by her mom. This 22-year-old believed that that's what led her to current interest in environmental engineering. Recycling trash in a sash. It's Angola. Argentina. Argentina considers herself a friend to all animals. This 22-year-old has been taking care of abandoned dogs since she was a little kid. Finding huts for mutts, it's Argentina. Two-year-old Aruba is in the process of learning how to shoot a pistol. She's getting private lessons from a very special police officer, her father. She's one sharp shooter, Aruba. Australia. Every night before Australia goes to bed, she washes the bottom of her feet. This 21-year-old says she can't fall asleep otherwise. Clean as can be, it's Australia!
Bahamas. 26-year-old Bahamas is the singer in a very popular band. She performs in venues all over this country and is currently working on a CD. You can't go wrong with a song from Bahamas. Belgium. Belgium is a big fan of movies, with Bollywood films being her favorite. This 20-year-old has a vast DVD collection at home. She likes her films, both Hindi and Hindi. It's Belgium! Bolivia. When 22-year-old Bolivia travels, she enjoys learning about the places she goes. She's fascinated by the many different cultures. There's something to learn at every turn for Bolivia. Brazil. Brazil really likes a nice pair of pumps. This 25-year-old estimates she has over 40 pairs of high heels in her closet at home. Breaking news, she loves shoes. Brazil! Bulgaria. 19-year-old Bulgaria says that although she's one of the smallest women in this competition, she more than makes it up for it with her big heart. Please welcome Bulgaria. Canada. 23-year-old Canada loves to cook. Her favorite cuisine to prepare is Brazilian food, and her specialty dish consists of beans, rice, and meat. We crave what she cooks. It's Canada. Cayman Islands. 26-year-old Cayman Island loves to travel and has the passport stamps to prove it. She leads Europe, Africa, and North America among the places she's visited. Where in the world is Cayman Island? China. 18-year-old China is very proud of her country and hopes to one day become a distinguished diplomat just like her grandfather. She's got pride on her side. It's China! Colombia. Growing up, 22-year-old Colombia was a great salesperson. Besides fruits and lemonade, she proudly sold rocks on the side of the road for extra cash. Well sold on Colombia.
Costa Rica. Costa Rica hopes to have her own preschool in the future. This 21-year-old is currently studying English so she can teach the language to children one day. Put your hands together for Costa Rica. Albania, Angola, Argentina, Aruba, Australia, Bahamas, Belgium, Bolivia, Brazil, Bulgaria, Canada, Cayman Islands, China, Colombia, and Costa Rica. Thank you. Croatia. 20-year-old Croatia loves a good film. She says comedy is her preferred genre and lists Julia Roberts and her favorite actress. Grab some popcorn. Enjoy. Croatia. Curacao. 24-year-old Curacao says that her eyes are very unusual for someone from her country. She claims no one in her nation shares her exotic look. Ladies and gentlemen, Curacao. Cyprus. Cyprus was raised in a small village with no brothers or sisters. This 20-year-old feels is the reason she's so close with her parents. Put your hands together for Cyprus! Czech Republic. 26-year-old Czech Republic has traveled to Kenya twice. The first time for leisure, the second time to volunteer in a hospital. Her big heart sets her apart. Czech Republic. Dominican Republic. 23-year-old Dominican Republic admits she has a sweet tooth and claims she can bake a delicious chocolate cake. She's sweet as can be, Dominican Republic. Ecuador. 19-year-old Ecuador has been accumulating photographs of interesting people. She currently has over 50 in her collection. Say cheese, it's Ecuador! Egypt! 26-year-old Egypt has a fraternal twin. She claims the two of them couldn't be more different as her sister is shy while she's outgoing. Please welcome Egypt! El 
Salvador. El Salvador likes an adrenaline rush. This 21-year-old loves roller coasters and wants to try bungee jumping one day. She's willing to do something thrilling, El Salvador. Estonia. Estonia likes to set goals for herself. If possible, this 25-year-old prefers to stay busy at all times. Please put your hands together for Estonia. Ethiopia says her friends tease her because she's always checking herself out in the mirror. This 19-year-old would like to work as a model. Her reflection is perfection. Ethiopia. allows her to help those in need. This 22-year-old sees herself working as a doctor or veterinarian, making healing appealing, Finland. France enjoys participating in water sports. The only problem is that she starts to panic whenever she finds herself in deep water. Ladies and gentlemen, it's France. Georgia. Georgia really wants a dog. Unfortunately, this 19-year-old lives in an apartment building where she isn't allowed to have one. Let's hear it for it. Georgia! Germany. In the past, Germany worked as an apprentice alongside a world champion hairstylist. This 24-year-old still occasionally cuts her friends hair. If your top needs a crop, call Germany. Ghana. used to work in a brand ambassador for a telecommunications company. In the future, this 23-year-old sees herself as a partner in a law firm. Ambitions is your mission when you are Ghana! Republic, Ecuador, Egypt, El Salvador, Estonia, Ethiopia, Finland, France, Georgia, Germany, and Ghana. Thank you.
Great Britain. Great Britain says her red, her flame red locks are hard to miss. This 27-year-old is the daughter of two ginger-haired parents. With a flair for red hair, it's Great Britain. Greece. 19-year-old Greece likes to have fun. In her spare time, she enjoys playing ping pong, going rafting, and spending time with her little sister. Always want to have fun. It's Greece. Guam. 24-year-old Guam has two pet chihuahuas, a boy and a girl. She enjoys putting sweatshirts on the male and skirts on the female. She likes to dress up pup. It's Guam. Guatemala. Guatemala won a modeling contest that sent her to California. Once there, the 21-year-old took part in a photo shoot where she spotted Britney Spears. You can hit us, baby, one more time. Guatemala. Guyana. In addition to ballroom dancing, Guyana has training in the dramatic arts. When she has time, this 19-year-old also enjoys writing poetry and curling up with a good book. With a need to read, it's Guyana. Honduras bad side. This 23-year-old martial artist has a black belt in Taekwondo. Breaking boards and hearts, it's Honduras. Twenty-one-year-old Hungary likes to design clothing. She often sews outfits for her friends and likes to design for herself as well. Making clothes for those she knows, it's Hungary. fishing. She said that she then she cooks her catch, especially if she traps some lobster that day. Fish is the dish for Iceland. India. Three-year-old India says it's necessary to think like a man but feel like a woman. Her friends have told her she's just like Jim Morrison trapped in Mother Teresa's body. Break on through to the other side with India. Indonesia. 
year-old Indonesia loves romantic places. She said she'd like to travel to Europe one day and is especially interested in visiting Italy. She'd feel at home in Rome, Indonesia. Ireland. Ireland would like to get her master's degree in business. This 21-year-old sees herself owning her own company at some point. She's all business, Ireland. Israel. 20 year old Israel is an adventure junkie. She has been skiba diving and would like to travel to Mexico one day to swim with sharks. She has declared she's never scared. It's Israel. Italy. When Italy was young, she had a pet chicken that she always kept with her. This 25-year even trained the bird, the bird to sit on her arm like a parrot. Please welcome Italy. Jamaica. 25 year old Jamaica traveled to New York recently. She only stayed for a few days, but she went to a lot of the local spots and had an amazing time. She's a New York state of mind. Jamaica. Japan. Japan learned how to bake by watching her mom. This 25-year-old says that people really seem to enjoy her cheesecake. She's loving the oven, Japan. Great Britain, Greece, Guam, Guatemala, Guyana, Honduras, Hungary, Iceland, India, Indonesia, Ireland, Israel, Italy, Jamaica, and Japan. Thank you. Korea. 23 year old Korea plans to start hard for her two years she has left in university. Upon graduation, she hopes to make it as a news anchor. Back to you in the studio, Korea. Kosovo. Kosovo likes to have a good time and hopes to own her own dance club one day. This 18-year-old says the name of her establishment would be simply fun. If you have a chance, come and dance with Kosovo.
Lebanon. Four years ago, 19-year-old Lebanon attended her mother's college graduation ceremony. She was proud, especially since her mom was a valedictorian. At the top of her class, it's Lebanon. Malaysia. 21-year-old Malaysia once burned her body during a fire-eating stunt. After going to the emergency room, it took her eight months to recover. Making the spot really hot, it's Malaysia. Mauritius. 23-year-old Mauritius has many career interests. She says it's tough to decide what to do for a living. At the moment, she's leaning towards becoming an attorney. She's in all for the law. Mauritius. Mexico. 21-year-old Mexico has a lot of buddies, most of whom are guys. Her friends often treat her like she's their mom because she's always caring for them. She's the gal you want as her pal, your pal, Mexico. Montenegro. 20 year old Montenegro doesn't cook often, but when she does, it's good. Her favorite dishes to prepare are lasagna and chicken. We're in the mood for some delicious food from Montenegro. Namibia. 21. Namibia is proud of her unique appearance. This 20-year-old has more than 10 beauty spots on her face and really likes the way they look. She's one of a kind, Namibia. Netherlands. Two years ago, Netherlands worked at a pizza place. This 19-year-old said it was a lot of fun baking the pizzas, and often she misses it. We wouldn't think it twice about having a slide from Netherlands. New Zealand. New Zealand has traveled all over Europe, but her favorite spot was definitely Paris. This 20-year-old, 22-year-old, loved the history and found it romantic and inspiring. She had approved of the Louvre, New Zealand. Nicaragua. 22 year old Nicaragua says she likes helping people. She really misses her old profession, working as a medical assistant. Pass the scalpel and enjoy Nicaragua.
Nigeria. Nigeria comes from a very large family. This 20-year-old says she learned a lot about respect from her six brothers and nine sisters. The Brady Bunch has nothing on Nigeria. Norway. Norway loves to laugh. In addition to being a fan of funny movies, this 25-year-old enjoys watching stand-up comedy. It's not a rumor, she likes humor. Norway! Panama! Three-year-old Panama says her best friend has been a big influence. She's taught her the importance of taking risks and other things essential to being successful. We expect big things from Panama. travel back and can't wait to visit Australia or Africa next. Please welcome Paraguay. points from around the world. Her father started the collection when she was young and she's taken it over for the past few years. She has a lots of strange change. Peru! She brings it with her wherever she goes. Put your hands together for Philippines! Poland! 20-year-old Poland has had some interesting experiences. Not only has she been a passenger in a Formula One race car, she once tossed a coin to start a pro football match. She'll represent your event, Poland. Puerto Rico. 
she was little, Puerto Rico used to always fight with her brothers and sisters. Now that she's older, this 20-year-old says she has nothing but love for her siblings. She's a fan of her clan, Puerto Rico. Romania. Romania says she has a lot in common with her dog. This 20-year-old and her pet share the same personality and both, and both are stubborn at times. Ladies and gentlemen, Romania. wants to study interior design, but it isn't her dream job. Above all else, she'd like to be a Bond girl one day. From Atlantis with love, Russia. Serbia. Serbia used to be a tomboy who only hung out with the boys. This 22-year-old says that when she was younger, she was an ugly duckling. She was aghast at her looks in the past. Serbia! because her brother forced her to play with him. Recently, however, she learned to appreciate the sport. Sinking the shot, it's Singapore! Slovak Republic. Slovak Republic says that one day she'd like to run a successful company. This 22-year-old is on the right track, currently studying economics at school. Please welcome Slovak Republic. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Slovenia! South Africa. South Africa says the most exhilarating thing she's ever done is skydiving. This 25-year-old says that afterwards, she felt ready to take on the world. Soaring through the air, it's South Africa. business student. She says she sees herself working as an executive in the fashion industry one day, hoping to cash in on fashion. Spain! Drive fast. 
she can often be found blaring music, cruising around town in her dad's car with the pedal to the metal. This Swede sure likes speed. Sweden! Switzerland. Switzerland wants models for photos in South Africa. This 19-year-old really enjoyed the experience and was excited to see both a penguin and a shark there. She got her kicks posing for pics. Switzerland. Tanzania lives traveling as her number one interest. This 24-year-old says the most fascinating place she's ever been is Mount Kilimanjaro, located in her home country. Looking chic at the peak, it's Tanzania. Poland, Puerto Rico, Romania, Russia, Serbia, Singapore, Slovak Republic, Slovenia, South Africa, Spain, Sweden, Switzerland, and Tanzania. Thank you. she once prayed to Buddha that her brother would get into college. When he was accepted, she danced in the streets to say thanks. Please welcome Thailand. Turkey has four sisters at home. She says that although they love each other, they constantly argue over the little things. Siblings fight day and night in Turkey. Turks and Caicos. 22-year-old Turks and Caicos loves playing softball. She says she excels at very position on the diamond, but prefers, pay, prefers playing shortstop. Hitting it out of the park is Turks and Caicos. In addition to being a world-class gymnast, Ukraine has some interesting hobbies. This 26-year-old enjoys underwater photography and dancing to hip-hop. When her work is done, she sure has fun. Ukraine! Uruguay. 
21-year-old Uruguay sees herself as a business owner one day. She hopes to eventually have her own line of clothing and beauty products. Be sure to stop by her shop, Uruguay. USA. 22-year-old USA says she was brought up in a quaint southern city where the people were hospitable. She was a creative child participating in musical theater. This southern belle is doing well. USA. Venezuela. When Venezuela was younger, she really wanted to join her school band. There was only one problem. This 18-year-old didn't know how to play an instrument. It's her goal to rock and roll. Venezuela. Vietnam. Vietnam has been swimming for over 10 years now. Although she's busy these days, this 20-year-old spends about three hours a week in the water. Keeping it cool in the pool, it's Vietnam. Zambia. Zambia says her father loves it when she cooks for her family. This 21-year-old specialty dish is green Thai curry. That's in the mood for some food from Zambia. Thailand, Turkey, Turks and Caicos, Ukraine, Uruguay, USA, Venezuela, Vietnam, and Zambia. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it for our swimsuit competition. Let's give our contestants one more round of applause. Now I know some of you have already picked up your favorites, but we aren't finished yet. No, 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 no. And before we, but before we begin the evening gown competition, Diana, we have a special treat for you. Known for his light, soulful tenor, this sensual singer released his, recently released his debut album, Feet on the Ground, all the way from London, ladies and gentlemen, performing his hit songs, what if I could, and reset to zero, please welcome Anthony Wright.
Hello. <laughs> I'd like to dedicate this to all the beautiful ladies in the house. And this is called Reset to Zero.
Ladies and gentlemen, give it up. Now we're uh, we're about to begin the evening gown uh, competition, the evening gown portion of the show. But before we do, there's a few people in the audience we'd like to uh, we'd like to recognize. That's yeah. right, Ed. Without the generosity of the following people, this production would have been possible. No way, Jose. First of all, Mr. George Marcantonis, president and managing director of Atlantis Paradise Island. And Ms. Bernice Walkane, the Director General of the Ministry of Tourism in the Bahamas. Also, please give a round of applause for the lovely Paula Sugar, the President of the Miss Universe Organization. Okay, Diana, I think it's time now that we see some of those, uh, those fancy dresses. What do you say? I know, I can't wait. I love this event because we get to see some extraordinary gowns which often represent the woman's style. You know, you can tell a lot about personality, the woman's personality about how she dresses, what she I, wears. I know you can, I, that's for sure. I couldn't agree with you more. So, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, the 2009 Miss Universe Evening Gown Competition. We begin the evening gown competition with Albania. Albania is currently studying medicine. She says she loves children and hopes to one day work as a pediatrician. Doing it for the kids, it's Albania. She has a lot of respect for Martin Luther King Jr. She's amazed at all he was able to accomplish in his life. She has a dream, Angola. Argentina. Argentina is more than just a pretty face. She says that our authenticity and values are what makes her who she is. Keeping it real with Argentina. She's one of the boys. Whenever he feels like practicing his soccer shot, he insists that she plays golly. Switching roles to stop goals. It's Aruba.
Australia. Australia says she really enjoys writing and hopes to one day author a self-help book for young girls. Please put your hands together for Australia. Bahamas. Bahamas is deeply compassionate and determined to succeed. She says she's faced a lot of obstacles, but has overcome them all. Nothing's going to stop her now. Bahamas. Belgium. Belgium enjoys meditating and says it helps her to unwind. In her spare time, she likes to listen to music and play Sudoku. She knows how to relax to the max. Belgium. Bolivia. Bolivia was once given the opportunity to fly a plane. She said the other passengers started screaming because the plane spun out of control. Ladies and gentlemen, Bolivia. Brazil. Brazil says she's committed to improving other people's quality of life. She's very proud of her past work with children. Let's hear it for Brazil. Bulgaria. Our contestant from Bulgaria not only studied ballet, she recently participated in and won an international folk dance competition. Getting down in her gown, it's Bulgaria. Canada hopes to be an elementary school teacher one day. She's currently working part-time as an early childhood educator. We're hot for teacher, thanks to Canada. Cayman Islands. While crossing the street a couple years ago, Cayman Islands got covered in dirty water when a passing truck went speeding through a puddle. Please welcome Cayman Islands.
China. China says that in addition to being well-educated and friendly, she enjoys helping others. In her spare time, she likes to dance and read. A woman of many talents, it's China. in a box. If you are looking for fear, you won't find it near Colombia. Costa Rica. Costa Rica likes to be fun and spontaneous. Two years ago, she rode a motorcycle from her home country to Nicaragua on a whim. She makes biking look striking. Costa Rica. wants to host her own talk show. She's a big fan of Oprah Winfrey and admires the way she inspires people. If you need advice, hers will suffice. Curacao. running after a stray dog. We wish she'd chase us instead. Czech Republic. Go 
Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic babysat her brother every day after high school, which taught her a lot about responsibility. She wasn't wild when watching a child. Dominican Republic. Ecuador. Ecuador once fell asleep under her mom's bed during a game of hide and seek. She awoke hours later to learn her panic family had reported her missing. She hid as a kid, Ecuador. a dream job, but she sees herself working one day doing something she loves. She's bent on being content. Egypt! El Salvador loves to bake and can make a mouth-watering cheesecake. She learned by watching her mom in the kitchen. Our stomachs ache for her cake, El Salvador. Estonia says fashion is very important to her. She also enjoys drawing and has been painting her own silk scarves lately for fun. Fashion is her passion. Estonia! Ethiopia. Ethiopia has three brothers, five sisters, and a dog. She's very close with her big family and couldn't imagine growing up without them. Having kin is in when you're Ethiopia. Finland. Finland likes to go fast. She was once driving around in a Formula One car and has always wanted to fly upside down in a jet plane. She's gonna need for speed. It's Finland. France. France was one chased through the streets by an angry cow. She learned a lesson that day. Don't get close to a calf when it's near its mother. Please welcome France.
Georgia. Georgia has always had a strong interest in mathematics and would like to run her own bank one day. With cash in her sash, it's Georgia. Germany. Germany works alongside her father, answering phones and making appointments at her insurance company. It's not bad working with dad when you're Germany. Ghana. Ghana likes babysitting her nieces and nephews. She really enjoys being around kids and hopes to have five of her own one day. Sounds like children are her future. Ghana. Croatia, Curacao, Cyprus, Czech Republic, Dominican Republic, Ecuador, Egypt, El Salvador, Estonia, Ethiopia, Finland, France, Georgia, Germany, and Ghana. Great Britain. Great Britain says she loves music. In addition to singing and attending live shows, she works in the industry as a project manager. Pump up the volume, it's Great Britain. While at the beach recently, Brit spotted a drawing child. She pulled the seven-year-old from the sea, bringing him to a lifeguard. She's a real lifesaver. Greece. Guam. Guam loves to stay active. She enjoys hiking, kayaking, and snorkeling, and is even in bowling league with her friends. Put your hands together for Guam. Guatemala. Guatemala loves going to weddings. She says that whenever she attends one, she finds herself being the first to get up and dance. If you tie the knot, save a spot for Guatemala.
Guyana. Guyana says that her personal trainer has a lot of influence on her life. The pair have worked together for over four years now. She has to admit, he keeps her real fit. Guyana. Honduras. Honduras works as a medical technician in forensics. You can often find her at the hospital or the morgue, performing an autopsy. She's to die for. Honduras. Hungary. Hungary loves all animals equally and she has several pets to prove it. In her home you'll find a cat, a dog, and yes, a snake. Ladies and gentlemen, Hungary. Iceland. Iceland is a very independent person. When she was 19, she traveled to Spain by herself just to experience something new. She flows on her own. Iceland. India. A few years ago, India hurt her ankle and was told to give up dancing. She worked through the injury and was rewarded with a dance scholarship. No pain, no gain. India. Indonesia. In high school, Indonesia was a student body president. It was a big job that involved giving speeches and representing fellow students. She's at the head of the class, Indonesia. Ireland. Ireland says nutrition was her favorite class in school. She likes helping people make healthy life choices. She's out of sight from eating right. Ireland. Israel. Israel is proud to have served in her country's military. She says that it helped her learn about herself. She protects and serves. So our applause, she deserves Israel.
Italy. Since she was a little girl, Italy has liked being the center of attention. She says that as long as she's on stage, she's happy. The spotlight shines brightly on Italy. Jamaica. When Jamaica was young, she collected Barbie dolls. Now that she's grown up, she's moved on to accumulating shoes, making the jump from a doll to a pump. Jamaica. in Tokyo, which exposed her to many different people. She has many friends from very diverse backgrounds. Put your hands together for Japan. Great Britain, Greece, Guam, Guatemala, Guyana, Honduras, Hungary, Iceland, India, Indonesia, Ireland, Israel, Italy, Jamaica, and Japan. Thank you. Korea. Korea went to Bali recently, her first time traveling without her parents. She ended up having a great time. Things aren't bad without mom and dad for Korea. Kosovo. Kosovo is very close with her three sisters. She says she didn't know what she would do if she didn't have them to confide in. Sisterhood has been good to Kosovo. Lebanon. Although she's more interested in academics, Lebanon has played tennis and basketball for years and recently gave badminton a try. Put your hands together for Lebanon. Malaysia. 
Felicia. When she was 18, Malaysia trained for the army. She says a lot of people think it's just for the guys, but she really liked it. The military isn't scary when you're Malaysia. Mauritius. Mauritius used to be afraid of the water until her mom encouraged her to take some swimming classes. She'll no longer collapse when asked to swim laps. Mauritius. Mexico. Mexico has been afraid of fireworks her entire life. She thinks it's because her dad once set off one in the house. She's filled with gloom when she hears a big boom. Mexico. Montenegro. Montenegro has a collection of interesting pictures she's got out of newspapers around the world. She keeps her clippings in a scrapbook at home. Please welcome Montenegro. Namibia. Namibia has always had an interest in the law. In the future, she sees herself as an established human rights attorney with her own practice. She'll fight for your rights, Namibia. Netherlands. Netherlands says her mixed background makes her unique. Her Asian heritage keeps her modest, but she's free thinking from living in Holland. We contend she's the perfect plan. Netherlands. New Zealand. New Zealand works as a construction property manager, but her true passion is flying. She currently works on getting her pilot's license. With her eye in the sky, New Zealand. Nicaragua. Nicaragua was a great athlete during her high school years. Her favorite sport to play is basketball, but she says the most challenging is polo. Playing sports of all sorts, Nicaragua. Nigeria. 
Nigeria's first love is dance, but she's tried her hand in music too. In addition to singing, she can always she can also play bongos and harmonica. She's a one-woman band, Nigeria. She can see herself publishing her own book in the near future. Put your hands together for Norway! While her friends worked as babysitters, Panama had a different responsibility. Her aunt used to invite her over to supervise a dog. Ladies and gentlemen, Panama. of a future leader in the world of international business. She says she really like to work as an importer exporter. Please welcome Paraguay. her conservative father was upset when she was nominated for prom queen. When she won, however, he was very proud of her. Put your hands together for Peru. Buckle up and for take off, it's Philippines.
Poland. Poland had an interesting experience in Australia. When she bent down to pet a kangaroo, it responded by licking the side of her face. Please welcome Poland. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico recently started training as a boxer. She says the sport has not only improved her stamina, it also has strengthened her focus. She's a real knockout. Puerto Rico. Romania. Romania has a vast collection of stuffed animals. She says there are over 200 of them scattered around her pink bedroom at home. Teddies consume her whole room. Romania. Russia. Russia is a big fan of house music. She was thrilled when she got a chance to work as a DJ at a popular club one night. She's grinning when she's spinning. It's Russia. Serbia. Serbia is really into extreme sports. She's been told she's crazy because bungee jumping is next on her to-do list. Some think she's nuts because she's got guts. Serbia. Singapore. Singapore celebrated her 21st birthday in Seattle. She has been to the United States four times and has many good friends there. With mates in the States, it's Singapore. Slovak Republic. Slovak Republic really likes motorcycles. Years ago, she would ride on the back of her dad's as he drove around with his friends. Put your hands together for Slovak Republic. Slovenia. Slovenia says she's a very modest and honest person. She says it's important to help those in need and treat everyone with respect. She treats others like her brothers. Slovenia.
South Africa. South Africa had the honor of meeting Nelson Mandela. She went to his birthday party and got to eat lunch with him. It must, it must be unreal sharing a meal with South Africa. music. She likes seeing live shows and tries to go to the opera as often as she can. If you'd like to meet her, head to the theater for Spain. dropping food on herself when she eats. For her 18th birthday, her parents brought her a bib. Who knew a slob could make our heart throb? It's Sweden. so that she has extra pocket money. Once she even worked as a gas station cashier, showing skills as a teal, it's Switzerland. to host her own talk show one day. She envisages herself helping people deal with family issues just like Oprah Winfrey. It's her goal to help heal your soul, Tanzania. Slovak Republic, Slovenia, South Africa, Spain, Sweden, Switzerland, and Tanzania. Thank you. She puts on a fashion show in front of the mirror. If that doesn't cheer her up, dancing does the trick. Please welcome Thailand. Oh! 
Turkey. Turkey says that although she doesn't enjoy playing sports, she enjoys watching soccer. She'd much rather be doing something artistic, though, like painting. Her heart is into art. Turkey. Turks and Caicos. Turks and Caicos is the shortest contestant this year, but says she possesses something that the other ladies don't. The spirit of her islands. Proven good things come in small packages. Turks and Caicos. Ukraine. Ukraine used to sing in one of her country's most popular bands. She's even appeared in a music video which you can be found on YouTube. She's a shooting star, Ukraine. Uruguay. No one knows a thing or two about makeup. Her other passion is shopping, and she was a big closet at home to prove it. She shops till she drops. Uruguay. USA. Growing up, USA liked to play dress up with her sister. The two would put on princess clothes and strut around the neighborhood. Walking through town in a gown, USA. Venezuela used to collect repair telephone cards. She still has a lot at home, but no longer has much interest in them. She disregards her old cards. Venezuela! Vietnam. As a child, Vietnam enjoyed reading comic books. These days, she enjoys illustrating them and is especially good at drawing anime characters. Her art sets her apart, Vietnam. Zambia. Zambia has been studying martial arts for the past 12 years. These days, she can be found teaching karate to kids along with her sensei. Ladies and gentlemen, Zambia.
Turks and Caicos, Ukraine, Uruguay, USA, Venezuela, Vietnam, and Zambia. Thank you. That brings us to the end of the 2009 Miss Universe preliminary competition. Let's bring out all the 84 contestants once again. Judges, our musical guests Anthony Gride and Michael Schwann, the choreographer of the 2009 Miss Universe pageant. And thank you, everyone in Atlantis Paradise Island, my lovely co host Diana, and to all of you at home and in our audience. Don't forget to watch the 2009 Miss Universe pageant on Sunday, August 23rd. And for those of you who are in the Bahamas, you can watch the show right here at the Appeal Ballroom Atlantis. Tickets are still available, so get them while you can. Thank, thank you. you. Good night. Good night.